Shalom Akim. First of all, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. That's the Heavenly Father in His name in the Hebrew. All right, in His Son's name in the Hebrew. And the Lashwan Kadash. All right, the Heavenly Father being Yahweh, and the Heavenly Father's Son being Yahweh Shai. All right, that's the true names of the Heavenly Father that was given under the heaven to the, the Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, which are the Israelites. All right, and of course, I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles that great millstone that rule well that's feeding the flock all right now this is met this is uh this is a little topic that i'm gonna go into is the gates of mercy all right like right now the gates of mercy is open right now you could get this truth all right if the lord dealing with you if you have the elect all right the lord special people who he chose to get this truth and he gonna deliver uh, d deliver out of great babylon and out of all of the uh other different uh Places across the four corners of the earth in which we've been scattered amongst the heathen and all of that and um, you know who he's gonna save all right uh, but right now it's about seeking Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai and that's the way you know we gonna be delivered all right so right now the gates of mercy is open this is the first precept this is Isaiah 55 and 6 it reads seek ye the Lord Yahweh while he may be found call ye upon him while he is near all right, so right now, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai is near right now. You know, we are we at the end of this thing right now. We only just waiting for, uh, you know, we basically waiting for these prophecies continue to continue to come to pass. You know, and you know, right now, like, you fucking, you gotta be a fool. You know, like I said, if you was able to get this word and receive it, if you got ears to hear, you know, you gonna get this word. All right. You know, the gates is murky. This is the mercy is, is open and it's the time. But when all this shit really start breaking loose, then they're going to be closed. All right. The elect going to be sealed. The Lord going to have all the believers, you know, he get all the prophets sealed and shit that who's supposed to get this word. And that's going to be it. Then it's just going to be fucking just nothing but death, destruction. All right. And you're going to have, of course, the, the, the deliverance of the Israelites, which are of the elect and on this side. And you're going to get two thirds of the Negroes, Latinos, and the Americans destroyed. All right, it goes on. It's Isaiah 55 and 7. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. All right. And let him return unto the Lord and he will have mercy upon him and to our power for he will abundantly power party. All right, that was the devil with the fucking bike and all that. These dudes engaging in bullshit. All right. So the Lord actually ultimately going to have mercy on us, all right? We got to forsake these ways and all of that. Start following the law, sex, commandments, which is a fucking constant that you hear in, in Great Millstone, all right? Which are the true leaders of Israel, all right? Not all these other fucking wicked-ass fucking camps and all of that. He, he, black Hebrew, like, Israelite camps and all that. Fucking, you know, all these, uh, you know, all, Jehovah wickedness and all of that. All these fucking people with these false doctrines, your, your fucking Jesus Christ, Baptist Church doctrine, that's all bullshit. That's going to leave you to destruction. We, this is the truth, all right? Um, and I'm going to go to the next precept. Um, uh, it's like, yeah, I'm going to just keep reading for now. It says, uh, for my thoughts are not your thoughts, all right? So the thoughts of uh, Yahweh Hashem Yahshua is not our thoughts, all right? Neither are your ways my ways, said the Lord, all right? And it's more just talk about, you know, the Lord, you know, you know, look, the Lord, he know everything and all of that, you know. And I mean, look, in everything which he know, we need to follow these law, statutes, and commandments. All right, so I'm going to go to the next precept. This is, uh, this is uh, Romans 10 and 17. It reads, so then faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. And that's, uh, you know, so faith is going to come from hearing this word, this truth. You know, you, you hearing this, uh, these scriptures and all of that. And you, you're going to, you, you're going to get your faith built up. You know, your confidence in Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. All right. Um, you know, and uh, the elect all going to get this word. All right. You know, um, you know, I'm going to go on to the next precept. Uh, you know, because we supposed to, uh, this, we supposed to follow the law, and commandments, which is promised to our forefathers and stuff. All right. This is uh, Jeremiah uh, 11 and 4, which I commanded your fathers in the day that I brought them forth out of the land of Egypt. All right. So, you know, the Lord, he actually delivered us. Uh, you know, he had uh, Moses, uh, 
you know, the prophet Moses leading uh, the Israelites out of, uh, you know, out of that that bondage that we was in, in that captivity. We were those same cat, what same fucking uh, Israelites that was there, and we them same Israelites here today. All right, you know, gonna be delivered out of Egypt. This is spiritually Egypt. All right, we gonna get delivered by Yahweh Bashem Shai by the way of Yahweh Shai, which is the Son of the Most High, who's on his second coming, gonna come back in on chariots and bring that deliverance onto us. All right, the chariots of the so-called year fools. All right, uh, and it goes and it says, from the iron furnace, saying, "Obey my voice and do them, according to all which I command you. So shall ye be my people, and I will be your power." All right, so look, the Lord, He sees you, uh, you know, of you being an Israelite. All right, and you follow His laws, His commandments, and He, you know, He's supping with you and giving you every wisdom, knowledge, understanding. You know you going you gonna be well, all right. You know how how is the Lord gonna be pleased with you if you don't even have no faith in Him and stuff, you know? And that's what it's coming to when you come into this truth. You know, you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans been putting your faith in all type of other bullshit and folly. That's all fucking wickedness. Return on you how well y'all was shy, all right? Um, and I'm gonna go to uh this uh this uh this uh scripture. Uh, this is uh, Jeremiah 10 and 1. Hear ye the word which the Lord Yahweh speaketh unto you, O house of Yasharala. All right, which is Israel. The Lord's only speaking to you, the, you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, which are the Israelites, not unto the other uh, heathen. He don't even fucking deal with the fucking, all these, the so called white man, which is Esau. He's not dealing with the fucking, all the other heathen, Ishmael, Elam, you know, which Ishmael is the so called Arabs. Elon, so-called East Indians, you got, you know, you got, you know, all the abundance outside of the fucking Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, all right? You know, the Lord ain't even dealing with, he only dealing with us, all right? Uh, uh, thus, this is uh, Jeremiah 10 and 2, thus said the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen, and that's what we did, we started to learn the ways of the fucking heathen out here, start to fucking eat pork and all that shit, start to fucking, you know, oh, adultery is fine, let me just start piping down fucking... You know, somebody fucking uh, wife and all that. Oh, let me, uh, hey, I, I just seen two niggas go, go do a fucking uh, drive-by and shit. Oh, I just seen fucking two niggas just, uh, you know, my homies done renting the Walmart and they, they fucking, you know, they, 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 they smuggling out the fucking TVs and shit at 12 o'clock at night. Fuck all that, man. The Lord said, that, you know, we ain't supposed to steal, all right? We got lost that commandments to follow. What the fuck is y'all doing? Turn, stop one learning the way of the heathen, all right? It says, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them, for the customs of the people are vain. All right? You know, the custom of these fucking people is so fucking vain. You got bitches that just make up their whole fucking face, and they fake as fuck, and, 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 and just, they looking for every attention under the sun, when they even got fucking men. All right? And that's, that's going to be another thing for another day. You know, but right now, the whole thing is, is that the conclusion is, y'all got to follow these laws, that's commandments. Return unto the Lord, Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai. The gates of mercy is open now. They're not going to be open forever, all right? That's, 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 I'm telling you raw. The, the scriptures is telling you raw. The prophets is telling you raw. And that's it. With that, I'm going to say Shalom. So look, a lot of y'all fucking people going to be left just like this. Like we said, the gates of mercy is open right the fuck now. Yahabai Shimmy Shai gonna close them. He gonna close them. And y'all niggas gonna be banging on it and ain't gonna be able to get the fuck in. Y'all not gonna be getting in them chariots. Alright? Not at all.